Yo, good morning everybody. We're just here. Tuesday morning. It's a bit early in the morning and we're gonna go and meet my mate Alex for a coffee. So keen, I'm so keen to see him. It's freaking freezing though. But anyway, I'll, uh, I'll see you there. This is how it went. We're just about to pull up uh, at the beach, which is so good. It's actually really not that cold at all today because it's cloudy. Um, there is a little bit of a dribble going on, but that's okay. I've got a big jacket and it's actually pretty good, I'd say, pretty good. Um, just a daily check-in. I feel a little bit under the weather still, a bit sick. Still feel, um, yeah, a bit, a bit drained. Um, but I know it's gonna be a good day. It's always a freaking good day. And I've got energy and I'm so keen for it, man. Um, yeah, this is gonna be sick. Um, coffee shop pumping. Mitch and Alex are gonna be on. Let's go. Give us a fit check out. Sure, mate. Just the, you know, the jeans, the white shoes. Black Sheesh. three quarter. You know, Get a load of this guy. He's still single. <laughs> is he? I am. But yeah. <laughs> so we can cut that bit out. <laughs> no, it's alright. I, I don't mind. Oh man, can you give us anything interesting that's happening today, Al? Happening today? Yeah. Hmm. Nothing today. Tomorrow I'm going into the city for a tour of a university. Hey, <laughs> yeah. okay. Yeah. What's happening? Uh, I'm going to SAE Institute. So oh, yeah. Go for a tour to see if they'd be a good spot for me to study. Oh, shit. Yeah. What do you think you'll say? Ah, uh, film. <laughs> Actually? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I want to study film. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> uh, like, 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 um, formally. Mm. Cool, dude. That's kind of cool. <laughs> shit, man. It's it. Guys, we just got a new cameraman for life. Love <laughs> 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 well, it. Right. It's uh, this is a good setup. It's a cheap setup, is what it is. It is. <laughs> It's a vlog lens, so, well, vlog slash wide angle. Yeah, no, it's good. Good versatility. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> What's happening, Al? Mate, we just spotted a good looking set of wheels. Lamborghini. Boom. My favorite color as well, mate. Oh, oh the wing doors. <laughs> holy moly. That's, I, I, I'm actually excited right now. <laughs> Oh, that bloke just loved his life. Damn. Damn. <laughs> that is good, dude. Oh, I can come take my eyes. Isn't it? <laughs> just chilling. I need to get myself. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> chat with Alex. It was so good to see him again. I haven't seen him for a couple of weeks um, and we just talked about the future and plans and ideas and thoughts and feelings and it was beautiful. It's so nice to have that type of relationship with your friends where you can just be and talk about things that matter. Um, so that was beautiful and now we're off. We've got a bit of a fun day I think. Um, I'm gonna go home post the vlogs. Let's go. We'll try to upload them at least and then I'm gonna go to um, get a haircut, which is going to be hectic. So, I don't know if you noticed, but probably did some of the videos, like I'm going bald, which is exciting, because uh, it's a big change, and I think things like this is kind of what makes you, you know, stronger in who you are. Like, I'm more than happy and comfortable with that fact, and I've known that for a while, that's what it's going to be like, but recently it's gotten a lot more evident and like my hair falling out all the stuff so what I want to do like this is the first time I've been to a hairdresser since before I left school which was a while ago so that's pretty cool um 
So I'm gonna go and just get it, them to make it a little bit shorter um, and then keep like kind of a mullet going and maybe, maybe I might just talk to them and just have a, have a see. I wanted to grow it out for one last time to go long, but I just don't think it's gonna get there. I don't have the patience for it as well. And like, I just, nah, probably just not gonna happen. Um, so I'm gonna do that. And then after this trim, I reckon we'll start buzzing it and like bleaching it and like doing like cool, cool drawings and stuff in it. I think that would be sick. Um, but yeah, right now, today, that's what we got on. So I think it might be a little bit of fun. Um, going to the barber shop and just, I've no idea what I'm gonna get. But we'll, we'll see, and it might look silly, but if it does, fuck it, I'll just buzz it off. And if it doesn't, sick, got a gnarly, gnarly trim. Um, yeah, so I'm going to do that, and then just edit, I reckon, for the day. I reckon that'll be what the, what the day entails, just a lot of editing, a lot of just getting shit done, doing some production plans, making some proposals, all that kind of business which would be fun. So it's all the stuff that I was meant to do last couple of days that I haven't been doing. Um, obviously the haircut is an addition because I just felt like it. Um, but yeah, I'll you'll obviously see a little bit more about it. So uh, enjoy, gang. Just been doing some editing, some file transfer and a little bit of research, um, talking to clients and that kind of stuff. Um, and now I'm just gonna go and get my haircut, which I'm keen for. Still got no idea what I'm gonna get, but I'm not gonna bring the camera in. I think I might just leave it in the Leave it in the car, maybe, maybe, yeah, leave it in the car and just be and just see what it's like and just have a chat with the dude and just be present for a bit, um, which will be good. So keen. So this is what I look like now, obviously, um, and we'll see what I look like after. Yeah, exciting, exciting stuff. So we just finished the trim. Um, but yeah, so that's that's that. Trim done. I'm gonna give it a couple of days. I don't know. Yeah, and just give it a couple of days. You can never diss a haircut on the first day. I reckon. I reckon that's. A, ooh, I reckon that's a dangerous crime to judge your haircut on the first day. So I know it'll grow out a little bit. And after like a little bit, if I don't like it, yeah, I'll just buzz it off like I was gonna do it anyway. So yeah, that's that. Just got to the beach. I just feel like having a dip. Um, I feel like quite tired, a little bit sick. So probably maybe not the best idea, but I also feel like the ocean is healing. Um, and it'll be really, really good to get in there and have some therapy, cold water therapy, and just sit for a second and just be. Um, yeah, yeah, so that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I think I've got a couple of, like, well, I've got a lot of work that I need to do today. Um, which is okay. Look, not gonna lie, don't know if you can see it from that angle, but looking at it from the side, I actually rate it. <laughs> cold and oh my goodness I'm hungry but we out here gonna have a quick dip get changed to the budgies and then get down to business baby so be good get all the loose hair off from the haircut and just yeah some cold water therapy and then we're on to the next baby let's go Alright guys, so it's not quite an empty beach, otherwise I definitely would have just gone in nude, but anyway, that's all good. We're going to go for a dip now, and I'll, uh, I'll let you know how we go. Let's do it. something that's been really evident today for me and I don't know why 
I don't know why I'm thinking about it, but I really just wanted to share the message of um, I am who I say I am. And sometimes I think that's really hard for people to, to, to come to terms with. There are so many things telling us who we're meant to be, identifying us as something, how we look, the way our friends talk about us, the way that our friends talk to us, the way other people talk to us, strangers, and what our jobs are, all these sorts of things. But it's so important to recognize that none of that matters. And at the end of the day, you are who you say you are. Just as I am who I say I am. That wasn't the friendliest angle for you guys, but hopefully the message still sticks. So, remember that. I am who I say I am. I am who I say I am. I don't know guys, what do you reckon? This is the, the after beach look. A little bit skewed but... I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, had a really nice dip and now we're gonna go and get some work done, baby. Um, which is good, it's about time to do some stuff. 12 o'clock is where the time just ticked. So, we're on. We're on like Donkey Kong. Uh, yeah, and that's all. Yo, what is up gang? Just about to do a bit of a shave. Uh, I don't know if you all find this satisfying or not, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Um, I don't usually use, I usually use like a razor, but um, today I'm gonna use this one because I can't be bothered uh, waiting for so long. But I, the reason I usually don't use this is because it cuts my skin sometimes. So hopefully that doesn't happen today. All right, anyway, let's go. Sweet guys, now we're all shaved, looking better. Feeling better, feeling good, feeling freaking incredible. Um, I'm not gonna lie, as the, the time is moving forward, the hair is growing on me. And yeah, I actually rate it a lot, which is pretty sick. So yeah, I'm not sure how it will be in the next couple of days, but as for right now, love it. Um, Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is go and cook some food. It's now lunchtime. Um, so what we've got today is steak and meatballs. Hell yeah! And oh my god, I am so keen. Let's go, let's go. Let's freaking go. We'll have another coffee. You may have noticed that I have started having a coffee counter right here, bang which is made from, obviously, this, this mug. Um, and the amount of coffees I'm having each day, uh, I just thought that was kind of fun. I wanted to keep track of them. So I thought, well, why not start today? So today, it's only been, because I had one with this morning with Alex, and then I have had this one when I got home. But right now, this is the last one. So what we're having for lunch today, steak, some leftover curry, um, and then, well there's well, some dishes here, but that's not good. Steak, leftover curry, and then I'm probably gonna have a coffee, and I'm gonna have lunch, a second lunch later. I'm gonna have meatballs and eggs. So I still get the eggs, eggs in, but God, God damn it, I'm so keen for a steak. And it's a six dollar steak. I mean, I know it was a rum, but I don't really care, it's a steak. So I was having a little bit of a chat with Alex this morning and he was saying he's not like he wants to do filmmaking but then he was also saying he wants to start creating content but he's not really sure exactly what he wants to do um, or how he wants to do it. So I don't know, is that something that if I talk a little bit more about my experiences and my plans that you guys would be interested in? Leave a comment to let me know if you would because I'd be really keen to collaborate with other people because I want to make proper film. 
I want to I want to do that. Like I would love to create films um, and pr go through the production process of planning and directing and writing and like, I want to collaborate with you guys. So if you're keen, let me know and let's tee something up because uh, that would be freaking awesome, man. Totally sick, bro. Um, anyway, steak's gonna be cooking momentarily and uh, curry's gonna be microwaved Take momentarily. Me out, I Holy shit, look at that. Yeah, boy. That steak is delicious. Bowl of curry. Oh, guys, I'm so hungry. I'm so happy with how that steak turned out. Let's go. It's gonna be a good day. It already is a good day. Let's go. So it is currently 4.09. And what we've done so far today is a lot of editing. Um, I got back and I've been doing lots of editing, which has been fun, and pitching and just sorting some content stuff out and responding to clients and all that sort of business, um, which is pretty cool. I have st I, I started uploading my daily vlogs right to YouTube probably four or five hours ago, and I can confirm not even one of them has gone up yet. <laughs> Oh man, it just takes so freaking long. I filmed my introduction video, which will be coming out soon. And I, yeah, currently I'm just sitting here waiting on the waiting page um, for that to happen. And because my computer isn't really the most powerful thing, oh shit, I can't edit at the same time. So I can only have my computer on one thing at a time, which for someone that works 100% off their computer, that's an issue. Um, yeah, so I've been working on the on the notepad and just writing stuff down, which has been fine. Um, but yeah, we're having we are having some efficiency issues today, which is definitely a struggle, um, and it's really pushing me in the direction of okay, I need to figure something else out. Um, yeah, but anyway, <laughs> I'm so, I'm in such good spirits. I feel great. I'm about to go and hit a leg session with Sam at five o'clock. So I've got 50 minutes before I do that, uh, which is exciting. Um, and I am really keen for it. Yo, uploading 100%. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Let's go. Boom. All right. That's awesome. We got one. Hasn't obviously isn't out yet, but this is exciting stuff. It's kind of weird that you're watching me upload this right now, but this is like 10 days after this one should have been posted. Hectic. Anyway, uh, I've got a lot of editing to do still. Um, so I'm going to go to the gym and then hopefully come back and, and do some more of that kind of stuff. And then tomorrow I've got a hectic day, um, really busy morning with Ike. Well, I'm going cold nips, and then I'm going to go and have a meeting with Ike uh, about the business, and there are lots of things that I need to do for that before we leave. Um, yeah, so, I mean, before we leave, sorry, before we get there. So, that's okay. I'm hoping to do a bit of that tonight. Um, I think that is definitely doable, depending on the situation um, that I find myself in. <laughs> Anyway, we're on to the next. Let's go. That's the next. Uh, that is the update for now. I will see you soon. Hopefully, you get some good gym content today. Yo, gang, we are just about to head to the gym. I have found my keys, which I had lost. Here's the fit. Let's go. Get the legs popping. Bang. What do you reckon? Hell to the yeah, boy. Let's go. All right, we're off. Catch you soon. So, as I said the other day, the car park was freaking freaked, man. There were so many people, and it took a very long time to get a spot. But we got one, and I wasn't giving up um, and going to another car park. So, 
We out here, about to have a big sesh. Sam's already in there because now I'm five minutes late because I wouldn't accept defeat, but I'm glad I didn't because I feel success now. So here we are, Revo Fitness. Let's go. Oh. So what are we doing today? Hitting a bit of legs. Yeah, what's the game plan? Game plan is real quickie. And oh, slide down. Um, we're going to hit leg press, heavy because we couldn't get the squats in. So we're going to do leg press, RDLs, for like moderate heavy weight, and then hip thrust to finish off. And uh, and if we're lucky and we got any more juice left, we'll do some leg extensions. But a lot of compound movements today, so feeling good. Yeah, it should have been a squat, but all the squat rats racks are taken by every man and their dog so it is what it is <laughs> so anyway i think i think you're on now for leg press mate <sighs> oh holy fuck man i actually feel rooted right now <sighs> so good though so the growth hormone kicking in already did you Any advice for people in their last set? Helps to have a spotter when they're not on the camera, but normally you just, you just go, go till you can't do any more, and then if you don't have a spotter, then leave one in the tank. But if you've got a spotter, last set, always go past failure. If you've got a spotter, always go past failure. Can't hurt. It's always good. Yeah, let's do it. We've just got railed hitting legs. Um, but now we're going to hit glutes, but I, I don't know where the glute machine is right now. I know where it is. I'm strong. Right. Follow me. We're following. Follow me. <laughs> so I'm still trying to figure out how to hold this fucking thing. But right. as you can see, the gym is packed. It's packed gym. <laughs> but that's okay. Sometimes the gym is just packed. And um, that's just the way it is. Look, here we go. Two nice looking hip thrusters. And then we got these machines here. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Uh, you go first or? You can go first. <laughs> Stewie's up first. Let's get it. The hero shot. Hey? Just saying the hero shot, mate. Back here on another episode of Snowy Lifts. Snowy's hip thrusting. That dude's going fucking brutal, man. That's all we can say. We're here at Scarborough Revo, Aloha Beaches. Scab 6019. Snowy's going down. Oh yeah, the hip thruster. All that built up energy, get it out. Let's go. Tune back in next week for another episode of Snowy Lifts. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of the vlog. Just out here doing hip thrusts. Got lots of built up energy. This movement doesn't get used very often, but that's all good. When it does, we're in. Oh yeah. This is where real glutes are made, baby. On the glute machine. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. God. What's up guys? Okay, this is very zoomed in and weird lighting, but I thought I'd get on here and talk about what's to come on Snowy Lives. So, it's all that very new to me, but I want to sit down and do some, some more um, mental health stuff. And I don't know if that'll be with Timothy or Thomas or Mitch or Flynn or I don't know. I want to get some boys involved and sit down and and uh, do like a like a round table mental health talk. But for right now, for Snowy Lifts, I want to just get myself comfortable in front of the camera and talk more about just gym and my story and mental health and hopefully aim to help one person, if not ten, if not a hundred, 
and uh, yeah, as long as I can change someone's life, um, I've done my duty. So yeah, stay tuned for what's to come. Um, just double checking that was recording because I don't want to say that again. But uh, yeah, see what's to come with uh, snowy lifts. But right now we're hitting calves. But I thought I'd just give a little little insight on what's to come. Stay tuned, people. Stay tuned. Keys? Yes. Have you got your keys? Yeah. Alright, snow lifts. Come for the weigh in. 94.6. Sheesh, mate. That's pretty huge. Alright. You weigh in? Maturus, the weigh in. Maturus, I wonder if we'd even be. If we were gonna fight, we wouldn't be in the same weight class. Which is good. If we were gonna fight. Yeah. I wouldn't want to fight you. I'll get some boxing gloves, mate. Let's go. I don't think you can stand probably when you bend down like that. Just let me yeah. 83.6. What did I get? Uh, 94.6. 10. 11 kilos. 11 kilos heavier. A froth. Like, big legs. I'm not mic'd up. Okay. Give me a slow, slow limp to the car. Slow limp to the car. She loved it. <laughs> she loved the slow limp to the car. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> she had a laugh at ya. Tweet is behind us. <laughs> Shit! Oh, watch out, watch out, watch out. I want to put that. <laughs> Bro, he's having a fucking staring competition or something. Jesus. <laughs> we out here, you know what it's like. If Snowy lifts around, everyone wants to stare. Sheesh. And we're back. So we just got home from the gym. It was an awesome sesh, as you guys saw. So keen. As I say every single time, absolutely love one, going to the gym with Snowy, and two, just spending time with him. So as far as what the rest of the night looks like, I'm gonna be sitting down, I just had a look at the YouTube videos and they're still uploading. And only two of them are up, um, like ready to be set as live. So I don't even know if those are gonna come out tomorrow or not, it might end up being the next day, which is a little bit annoying, but at least they're in the process and they're done now. So it's just a matter of time. So what I'm gonna be doing is rest night, have a bit of a cheeky feed, I'm not sure. I think Dad said that we're gonna have steaks, which will be awesome, so double steak for me today. So keen, fridge is full for food tomorrow. And then, yeah, just sit, sit back, do some editing tonight, make sure I get on top of it. Got a bit of a busy morning tomorrow, cold nips, and then going straight to um, a meeting with Ike in the morning to talk about some business stuff, which is so exciting and I'm so keen for and I have not finished prep for, um, but that's okay. I need to do some of that tonight as well while I'm doing the editing or waiting for the stuff to upload. So honestly guys, I'll probably say goodnight now and put the vlog away and just sit down and smash it out. Um, yeah, I hope that you guys had an absolute ripper of a day because I did, I had a great day, feeling awesome and I've got so much energy I know coming tomorrow, it's gonna be an absolute ripper. So with that, peace out. Have a great night, great day, much love.